And right now at noon, celebrating the 4th of July in South Florida might mean a weekend out on the water. But local law enforcement agencies are reminding people to stay safe. Mm -hmm. CBS 4's Deborah Suverine is live in Miami with the details on Operation Dry Water. Deborah? Yeah, that's right, Maribel and Candice. You know, this is all about making sure people are, are safe. Law enforcement officials will be out in higher numbers this weekend, and it's something they do every 4th of July, right, to make sure people are safe. But if you are heading out to the water this weekend, there are a few things you need to know. Alcohol and boating do not mix, and we've seen a lot of tragedies because of that. Law enforcement gearing up for a busy 4th of July weekend, and they want to remind anyone heading out on the water to be prepared. It's always very important to have two forms of communication. Make sure your cell phones are fully charged or you have a charger for your cell phone. But there's also the Maritime Radio Channel 16. That channel you can reach any agency on if you have an emergency out in the water. Coast Guard, FWC, and several partner agencies announced Operation Dry Water on Thursday, which will include a regulated navigational area in Key Biscayne on July 4th. From 7 p.m. on July 4th to 2 a.m. July 5th, all vessels within the regulated area are required to transit no more than 15 knots. That kind of limit the amount of traffic and make a little bit everybody a little bit more safe. And if you're going out on a chartered boat, make sure they're legit. Miami is known for the illegal charter capital of the United States. Make sure that you challenge that operator. Um, ask him if he has a Coast Guard credential uh, that looks just like this to ensure that you're at least operating um, with a person who has been properly qualified to take you out on the water. And officials say you should also have all of your safety equipment on board. That includes life vest, a throwable, a fire extinguisher, flares, a whistle, or any other device that produces sound. That's the most important thing, safety, so that everyone can go out, enjoy themselves, have a good time, but make it back home safely. And if you plan on heading out with children this weekend, it's important to know that anyone under the age of 12 years old must have on a life vest at all times. We're live on Miami Beach. I'm Deborah Souverain, CBS 4 News.